Hey folks, uh, today I'd just like to do a little sound comparison between what uh, many people com consider as the uh, American guitar sound compared to the European guitar sound. And of course we're talking about acoustic guitars here and um, I guess when it comes to acoustic guitars there's a lot of things that make up the uh, the sound or the, the sound character and uh, one most important thing is the uh, how you stabilize the top and uh, there are different uh, factors that uh, uh, the different schools uh, apply and uh, without going into them uh, uh, I guess what is considered as a flagship of European guitar style is uh, as by many considered as the uh, guitars made by George Loudon and here I have a, uh, a Loudon F35 and uh, this one has Adirondack spruce and uh, mahogany back and side and this is actually Cuban mahogany and um, the uh, American counterpart would be, uh, uh, or it could be a lot of things. In this case, it's a Collings um, OM41A. So this is a OM, this is a OM size guitar, and the uh, top is um, Adirondack spruce, just like the Loudon. But the back and sides are rosewood, so it is perhaps some degree. Uh, comparing pears and apples and uh, bearing that in mind uh, again this is just a uh, this is just a uh, way to give you a rough comparison it's a beautiful work done on this calling as you can see anyways without further ado I uh, will be playing mostly uh, or I will be playing only finger style and uh, uh, I'm in dad get <laughs> So as you can see, the harmonics sing very well on this callings. Now the Loudon. Playing a little bit of blues, I'll 
also a little bit more American music just to again give you the sound comparison. <laughs> and I hope this comparison give you an idea of uh, the sound difference between the two uh, luthiership schools of luthiership cheers <laughs>